Hey everyone, this is Stevie here, and today I'm going to be showing you how we can make two lines perpendicular to each other. So, what we're going to do is create a sketch here. It doesn't matter which plane, but we're just going to take two lines. It doesn't matter where you draw them, I'm going to draw them kind of skewed like this, a little bit. So, now, let's say we wanted to make this line be perpendicular to this one, so that it's going straight down this way. Now, the way we can do that is we collect this we select this perpendicular tool up here and we're going to choose this line first whichever line you choose first will be the line that the second line will become perpendicular to so in this case when we select this line we should expect it to go straight down like this and there you go now i'm going to control z that just so that we can see that whenever we select the second line so whichever line is the second line, it will become per perpendicular to the first line. So we're going to click on perpendicular once more and select this one first this time. And once we select that, you see that it is now perpendicular. And this will always be like that. It will stay perpendicular no matter how you move it, whatever dimensions you give it, you know. It will always stay perpendicular. You can make this 100 and it will stay perpendicular. The only thing is that the way you have to get rid of this, if you want to make it so that you can move this around again, you have to find that perpendicular symbol right there. See that little guy? That tells you that these two lines are perpendicular. So all you have to do is hit delete, and that gets rid of the constraint, and there you go. You can choose to move it around again, albeit <laughs> it is kind of wonky because I put this other constraint on it. Whenever you dimensionalize something, it constrains it. So let me zoom out real quick. But now you can see that they are in fact no longer perpendicular to each other. And we can do that one more time. It's pretty simple, just hit perpendicular, and there you go. So that's all for now guys. Please like and subscribe, comment down below what you'd like to see next, and we'll see you in the next video.